Right. If you don't know what cryogenics or cryonics is, uh, now's the time to find out. Some people, when they die, like Austin Powers, or if rumor has it to be true, Walt Disney, uh, they have themselves frozen in liquid nitrogen. The plan is that when a cure comes up for what killed them, that they will be thawed out and that uh, they can then be resuscitated and cured. The question is, does that work? Look at a nice flower here. Flowers are made up of living cells, just like humans. They've got all sorts of uh, things in them, like DNA, ribosomes, uh, chromosomes, uh, all sorts. Uh, they have the exact same workings that we have. Uh, the other thing that they have is they're also mostly water. What happens to water when we freeze it? Now, water is one of the very few substances that when it freezes, it expands. So you should hopefully be able to see in just a moment here. That the flowers expanded quite a bit. Hmm. Frozen flower, take one. I guess that'll be the last take, too. So I've still got a few petals in here. I'm going to try and remove them and just kind of drop them on the tabletop to see what happens. Not an extreme, extreme cracking, is there? But you can see that they're very brittle. So brittle that when I'm even trying to pick them up, they're breaking inside the uh, door flask here. 